Ford Protocol's got five different smart contracts, and today we're going to be looking at the proof of ownership. Ford Protocol supports the recognition and protection of intellectual property of different content creators. So when an educational content creator uploads his content to Ford Protocol's platform, they can protect them by registering them as NFTs, which are non-fungible tokens that uniquely register and identifies each separate part of the content on the blockchain. The proof of ownership mechanism will be used to register the following types of digital content on Ford Protocol. Firstly, certificates and diplomas or certification of completion. You know, online education has its limitations and one of them is the difficulty in providing oversight on a student's activities and progress. Ford Protocol certificate verification between students and third parties via QR codes or dynamic authorization codes solves this challenge. Another one is copyrighted materials. An NFT is a unique digital asset or a token. It can be minted, recorded and traded on Ford Protocol's blockchain. It's very useful in determining the authenticity and the ownership of a particular asset or item. And Ford Protocol facilitates the creation of NFTs, their management and trading. For example, English Ford's NFTs could include revenue generating digital pages, poetry, concept articles, quotes, and many more other things that would fit into the English language learning landscape. The renting or you know, paying a fee for the licensing of NFTs. So materials that creative had that they want to license out to rent them out to use of the platform um, that wishes to acknowledge their ownership over them. Another one is papers and quotes. So let's have a look at a couple of target deployments of where we could use this proof of ownership. We could integrate into NFTs and copy -based, you know, copyright based platforms for uh, professors, for writers, um, for journalists, and a lot of other people that are actually publishing works on platforms like poemhunters.com. Um, we could integrate them into camera filter mobile apps in the assisting and converting of images that are shot through the app to NFTs at one click. There are so many different integrations where you could use this proof of ownership smart contract that is useful for protecting the underlying copyright of these content or types of content that are produced by these creators.